Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, kids of all ages, welcome back to This is Minecraft. That's right, folks, today we're in our single-player world, our reboot in the 1.9 pre-release. So let me show you a little bit of what I've done since last we joined each other. Um, I dug all the way down here to level 40, or I'm sorry, not level 40, level 10. Uh, level 10, according to Zazuma, um, <clears throat> Zazuma Void, uh, level 10 is the best place to find diamonds. I have not found any yet, but that doesn't mean we won't anytime soon. Did find some gold, did find some redstone, haven't mined any of it yet, also found some lapis, which means that we can start getting going on, uh, on some enchanting here pretty soon, but that is not, uh, that is not what we're going to work on today. Notice something missing here? Yes, that's right, there's wood missing here. So, <clears throat> we need to, uh, Oh, I got some strange feedback in my ear. I wonder what that is. Um, hmm. Anyway, got some strange feedback. If I do this, I can hear that. I wonder. Um, hopefully, you guys can't hear that feedback. Hopefully, it's just me. But uh, anyway, so yeah, what we're gonna do today is we need more wood. Now, I put that little, <laughs> that little, sorry excuse for a tree farm, uh, up on the surface. Uh, and uh, I don't. It's that's not going to work. We're not going to be able to use that. It only do. It only does six trees at a time, and not very efficiently. So what we're going to do is we're going to actually get going on a little tree farm today. Uh, we're going to go over. I found a perfect spot for one. Is it still nighttime? Can I still sleep? I can. Good. Let's go ahead and sleep and make it daytime. <coughs> make all those big baddies burn off and I got a bunch of sand and I, I got enough sand actually to do 40 trees okay so let's go ahead and go out here yeah yep you're dead haha -ha. so let's go over here I found a nice little spot right up here go up on top of this hill and then right over here right down there. See those cows? See where those cows are? I think that is a great place to put a tree farm. So we're going to go down here and we're going to go ahead and lay this out. Now like I said, I got 40 pieces of glass. What am I going to do with the glass? Well, I'm going to stunt the growth of the trees. That's what I'm going to do. So <clears throat> what we need to do is we need to figure out a way. Do I have any dirt on me? I do not. That's okay. Um, we have to fill this in. But what we're going to do is we're going to lay it out so that we can get 40 trees in this area. So I figure what we'll do is we'll do uh, five rows of trees, eight rows deep. Does that make sense? So so five different columns of, uh, of eight trees. I think that's probably about uh, about the best way to break it up evenly. So I think I've got, oh, I've only got 30 trees here. Whoops. No, that's no good. Uh, I heard something. I don't know what it was, but I heard something. Uh, anyway, so let's go ahead and see if we can't lay these out in such a way that we can get as many trees as we want. So if I plant one here and then go one, two, three, four, five, and plant another one here, five, yes, five. So give me this, give me this dirt. Let's put that right here. I bet that's what I heard. I better heard a bet I heard a, uh, <clears throat> a cow. So one, two, three, four, five, and then another tree. One, two, three, four, five, and then another tree. Is that four trees now? One, two, three, four, yep. Oh, I think this is gonna work. So one, two, three, four, five, and then another tree. So yeah, that's gonna give us five trees. Now can we go eight rows deep? So one, two, three, four, five. No, five, separate by five. Three, four, five. That's how many? That's one, two, three, four. Okay. Ooh, I'm going to run out of room. I can see it now. Yep, I'm going to run out of room. Hmm. Well, if we did... If we did five by five, that would be 25 trees, right? I think 25 trees down here would be pretty good. Why don't we go ahead and do that? Why don't we just do... 25 trees um, just because so let's see here okay what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna lay these out and I'm gonna do some terraforming too so that we can uh, so that we can fill this all in right here 
and, uh, and get this to be as efficient as possible, I may bring some extra dirt and actually raise these up one level also so that we can do some, uh, some nice designs on there around the outside. So let me gather up some stuff, and uh, <clears throat> when I come back, we'll give you a little progress update, okay? Okay. Okay, so all of the, uh, all of the terrain is leveled. Skeleton? No. Um, all of the terrain is leveled, and as you can see, I've got all the trees planted. Uh, what we need to do now is above each tree, and I kind of missed this one right here. I need to get this out of here. I want to put these grass or these glass blocks in. What those glass blocks are going to do is they're going to keep the trees from getting to be those uh, uh, those uber Franken trees, you know. Um, Yeah, they're going to get those trees to be to, to not be those uber franken trees that you know that have branches that go like everywhere. Um, they're going to limit the tree to that height. Uh, oh, get rid of that one too. But I need to go in and I need to put those above every single tree in here. So that's 25 glass blocks that I've got to get put in, and I'd like to get them put in before these trees get to be completely outrageous. So uh, we just go up seven blocks. We come over one so that we're right above the tree, and then we put down a glass block, like so. Um, you've probably seen that trick done before. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe you haven't. I don't know if I've ever shown anybody that I do that. Uh, I think I did show that in my old, um, my old tech world seed. Uh, I think, ooh, is that the right height? I don't know. Is that the right height? That's one, three, four, five. Eh. <laughs> Let's go over here and do this one. Put that one right there. Put this right here. And go up here, do the same thing. So yeah, that's going to be the next thing that i got to get done on this, is go around and finish putting all these glass blocks in. So I'm going to go ahead and finish that, and then we'll think about something that we're going to do on the ground to, uh, to kind of make this place look pretty cool. Oh, and in case you missed it, by the way, full set of armor. Uh, that mine over there was very good to me. We got, uh, we got lots of iron. I think, I think we've got like 40-some iron blocks that we got to, or not iron blocks, but iron ore that we've got to smelt up. But, uh, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and finish up these, uh, these glass blocks, and uh, when I come back, we'll work on uh, decorating out the, uh, the floor of this thing. So we'll see you in a minute. Alrighty, so here we are. We're on our way back over to the tree farm from the uh, from the mine. We had to go and get some more cobblestone uh, because we are using a butt ton of it. Um, so as you can see, I've got a grid kind of started laid out here. Uh, right now what I'm doing is I'm going around the outer edge. This will be the very outer edge of the tree farm. Um, <clears throat> we're using cobblestone because, well, that's, that's what we have. <laughs> we have lots of cobblestone. Um, but uh, I'm also thinking about what I want to use inside of here. So, like right here, uh, if I put this pod, let's say, oh, let's just put this pod together right here. Um, whoops. Hey. Hey. Did I? What did I do? Oh, I don't know. Okay. Interesting. So, if I put this together and make this one little pod here, what I want to do, what I'm thinking about doing, is like going like this all the way around. And so that what that'll do is that'll give that a little bit of that 3D texture, you know? Oh, hey, lines. Huh. Interesting. Um, that'll give it the kind of like a 3D texture. But what I don't know is what do I want to use in here? Um, I don't know if I want to maybe do, maybe do gravel. Um, I don't have any gravel yet, so I can't really do that very easily. But, uh, but I want something there that's going to give it a little bit of texture, a little bit of depth. Whoops. Um, you know, just kind of make it look... Uh, make it look more natural, I guess, uh, rather than manufactured. Um, you know, I mean, of course, this is a tree farm. It's going to be manufactured, but at the same time, I want it to look, uh, I want it to look a certain way. If you guys have any ideas on that, as far as what I could put in there to kind of separate the cobblestone stair from the cobblestone path, uh, I would be very interested to hear that. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and just keep right on rolling with this all the way around this thing. And, uh, and then when I come and, and get the stairs put in, and then when I come back, we'll, uh, we'll see what we've got to do to maybe light this place up so that uh, we don't get any mobs in here while we're waiting for trees to, f trees to grow. Uh, and that way we can come back and, and get a bunch of, uh, a bunch of, uh, a bunch of wood. 
Okay, so yeah, we'll be back. Well, there it is. Uh, there's the completed grid pattern for the uh, for the tree farm. Um, what we're going to do next, I think, is we're going to go ahead and we're going to place some torches uh, at the intersections. Um, this is not, of course, going to be the permanent lighting solution. Um, but uh, we're, uh, what I think I want to do is I think what I'm, I want to call this I want to call this our arborarium, maybe. Um, you know, you got an aquarium. You know. Uh, so this could be our arborarium. Uh, I don't know. Tell me what you think of the name. Um, but I think I want to close it in eventually. I don't. I don't have the resources to do it yet. Uh, I'm, I'm also out of torches. I need more torches. Um, yep. Yeah, need more torches. Need lots more torches. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking. You know, thinking maybe arborarium. That's that. That name has potential. But uh, this is definitely going to be the spot where we do all of our tree type stuff I until eventually we get ourselves a, uh, you know, like an, uh, a redstone controlled uh, automatic tree farm kind of sort of thing. Um, but this is the decoration type one. So <clears throat> what I'm thinking about doing also, whoops, misplaced torch. Uh, what I'm thinking about doing also is diorite in the center there. So we're going to put one of those together real quick, and then we're going to plant the rest of these trees. And I think that's probably going to do it for the episode for the day. Um, but we're going to try some uh, we're going to try some diorite and see how that looks in there. I'm not real confident that it's going to be good, but uh, we'll give it a try. So I got some right here. We'll do a couple of them and see how it looks. I'm not sure I'm going to love this. I'm also not sure that I'm going to hate this. Um, you know, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Hmm. I think I'm going to go with it. I think I'm going to go ahead and put this in. Tell me what you guys think uh, as far as the block choice here. Whoops. Misplaced much? Uh, yeah, tell me what you guys think of the block choice here. And, uh, um, and we'll go from there. Ooh. If you've got some other ideas, we might try it and just see how it looks, okay? Uh, but yeah, I think, I think, folks, uh, let me check on a couple of things. Uh, check some materials and see how much more diorite I've got, because I'm definitely going to need more than what I've got in my inventory. But uh, let me check on a couple of things, and I'll come right back to you, and uh, we'll probably call the episode from there. So we'll see you momentarily. Okay, so my suspicions were confirmed. We are most definitely out of diorite, but I've got to tell you, I don't hate that. I don't hate that at all. That looks. I think that looks good. I think I'm. I think I like that a lot. Uh, of course, anxious for you guys' opinions. Uh, let me know what you think about the uh, the color selection there. I know a lot of. Uh, I know a lot of people don't really necessarily care for diorite. Um, I think it's a very underutilized block. Uh, I think it has its place in the game. I think it. I mean, like here. I think it really adds just the right amount of contrast in here to make that look. Uh, to make that look appealing. Uh, but what we're going to do here first, what we're going to do here next, um, and I'm probably going to end up changing this out for some different for some different blocks, is we're going to go ahead and put some stairs in here uh, in a couple of places, like right in the center maybe of each of these uh, of these little pods. So here, uh oh, need more stairs. Oh, I got some. Good. Um, like here, and then over here maybe also. Uh, of course, I got to do some terraforming over here. I think. I think this is the. Yep, yeah, this is it. So we'll have to do some terraforming over here, so that we can get up there even. And then this side over here, we won't do anything with, uh, just because of its close proximity to the uh, to the mountain here. But uh, let's go ahead and plant these trees so that we can get them growing. And uh, oh, hey, there's a skeleton. Where's he at? Ow! Oh my gosh! Ow! Ow, where is he? Oh, he's got armor on. Man, he's got armor, but I got a bow. I got a bow, dude. Don't be messing. Oh, I'm out of arrows. Dang it. He doesn't see me now, but we're going to have to bum rush him. Got him. Wow, that was close. We're going to have to eat something. 
because he's going. He almost wrecked us. Ooh, he almost wrecked us. Um, <clears throat> good thing about health regen in 1.9 is once you start eating, man, oh man, your health comes back quick. I mean, look at that. It's coming back like nicely. Um, but yeah, I want to go ahead and get these trees planted while we can. Get all these trees planted so that they can start growing because we're going to need a butt ton, a metric butt ton of, uh, of wood here in the next couple episodes for the plans that we've got. Um, I want to get started on that dock over by the mine. Uh, I also am going to, I'm also going to do a couple of searches for some good tutorials on how to build a ship. Um, because like I said, I want that little port to be kind of a import export kind of a, kind of a thing. So if you guys know of a, uh, know of a good tutorial that, uh, that would show me how to, uh, how to build a good boat, a good shipping type boat, I'd love to see it. So you can share that in the comments. Um, yeah, but I think, I think we've gone just about as far as we can go on the tree farm today. I will get to mining and get some more diorite. Uh, that way we can finish this up. But uh, let me know what you think. I think it looks pretty good. Eventually we'll close it in. It'll have a glass roof and we'll be protected from all the mad, uh, you know, the, the mad baddies out there. But uh, yeah. So anyway, thanks so much for watching, folks. I surely hope you enjoyed uh, viewing this episode. Uh, if you did, make sure you hit that like button. Also, don't forget to subscribe. If you, uh, if you hit that like button, we might be able to do something for you. Uh, in the last season, in the last, uh, in the last world, we had the subscriber monument. We're probably going to do something similar to that again, and uh, and maybe even some other types of recognition. So, anyway, thanks so much for watching, folks. We until next time, we will catch you on the flip side. We'll see you later. Bye bye. <laughs>